Hey everybody, this is Mark and Nelson, Seneca Relics. Today is uh, Saturday, June the 13th, I believe. It's been a while since we've we found anything worth filming. <laughs> uh, and past, past few hunts have been kind of dry. I have a tip exposed, reason for primary ignition. <laughs> and I can see the flake scars on it, so we know it's, it's a work piece. It's just we can only see the tip of it laying there. Huh? All right, here we go. Pour out. Oh man, is it trashed? <sighs> Uh, not the nicest point I've ever seen, but oh, I, no, that's not trash. it's a point. Yeah, that's all right. Uh, typical of what we find here, we're, we're in Putnam County. Yeah, we are We are not in Mason County today. Yeah. Not too bad. Kind nope. of water-worn pretty bad. That's all right. That, we, all right. Here, wow, it's helter, yeah. helter, helter, skelter, swelter. And, <laughs> it's pretty bad. Uh, we're going to move along because we hear thunder in the distance. So hopefully we can get a, a long honey in and we'll be back with you. <laughs> uh, it's been about 10 minutes since Mark found that last point. I got another point. <laughs> I was over there on the other side battling rattlesnakes. <laughs> ah, he's over here pulling points. He's got one. <laughs> he's got one right, right on, top. on top. You can see it in the I can scrubs see it, there. Man, right on right top. on top. Dixon style looks like. Oh, that's sweet, dude. Oh, that's so cool. Well, that's not so cool on that side. Let's go back to this side. Well, you could go back to my side. <laughs> <laughs> I like that side just fine. Yeah, uh, not too bad. I'm, no, sir. I'm, I'm real happy. I like that base style. It's cool. All right, that's two in a, just a few minutes here in this same general area. So. Yeah, well, we got a lot more to hunt. We're back after it. Later. Well, I'm not hot anymore. <laughs> We uh, got caught in a downpour. Yeah, big one. And nowhere to go. So I, I did <laughs> finally find something. I'm <laughs> having a little trouble getting this soggy cigar lit. Oh, it. we're soaked. I think it's broken. It looks ratty. You ready? Yeah. It's an interesting color, though. The red man reaction. Oh. Ah, oh. Dissatisfaction. <laughs> ah. That's terrible. Well, that's a point. You know, the last time we were in this creek in January, we brought a guest with us, and he absolutely worked us over. So, Today the thunderstorms are absolutely working us over. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're back after it. Hey, everybody. <laughs> this is Mark and Nelson, and today we hunted in Putnam County. We got rained out. We had to leave a little earlier than we would have liked because of the thunderstorms that came through. We, yeah, we, we got were, we were a bit soaked. We got totally saturated. Had to deal with snakes. It was bad today. <laughs> it was a rough day. Uh, today's finds. I'll start with those. There's the two the two relics you saw here. I'll get to those in a second. But uh, Mark found the two nice ones today. We we called that one a Dixon, but in looking at it, yeah, the serrations. It might be a a Kirk. Don't know, but it's cool. Quite cool. Kind of junky looking from the canal black, but it's not bad though. Typical of bad. that creek. Yeah. Here's another dark point. Not too bad. A little thick, but mm -hmm. it's all right. Uh, my only, I won't even call it complete. The base <laughs> snapped off there, but this little clunker I found after uh, after the rain saturated me. This here though. Look at this base. Uh, Can you imagine what that thing would have yeah, looked like? That's a heartbreaker. If they would all been there. It's got that really distinct kind of Graham Cave looking. Oh, it's really cool. Yeah, well, it would have been really cool. It would have been really cool. <clears throat> and, uh, when, when we were out at Flint Ridge here a few weeks ago, we talked to some friends of ours out there, and we told them that we would show these artifacts during our next cleanup. So here you go. Yeah, this here, this Thebes. Expanded base Thebes. Absolutely beautiful. Mark's collection. Uh, I'm guessing a Coshocton flint maybe, or I don't know what it is, but it is absolutely stunning. <sighs> Perfect. Those, those. It's a killer. Those little barbs are worked that way. It's got the expanded notches. Really, really nice. Heavily ground on the base. The only point I got in my collection, really, that I bought, I was... Uh, with the person when he found it and he sold it to me and 
Yeah, when you were 12. When I was 12. <laughs> I, so I you can imagine he didn't pay top dollar. Yeah, I didn't acquire the point until I was in my 20s. So, uh, so uh, and, it's mine now. And this here, this is slate, gray slate. And um, I was walking out of a field when I was, again, a teenager. And had just kicked a clump of dirt and saw something roll out of it as I was walking out of a field. And this rolled out. Show this little hash yeah, marks there at the top. Serrations they've got kind of notched into it here. Is that not cool? Yeah, too bad it has a little plow dang on it there, but but still that's a killer. Yeah, nice pendant. That is cool. Beautiful. Uh, Alright again, today is uh June 13th, 2015, and we hunted Putnam County and wanted to show those both of those are Putnam County finds by the way. Yeah, we uh, we are hunting a, a creek we've we've now named. <laughs> Yeah, we call it uh, Highway 420, yeah. and uh, we have a reason for that. We we do have a reason for that. <laughs> and uh, yeah, last time we were there, I think the very last time we were there was in January, and had a guest with us, and man, he pulled out the best thing I've ever seen come out of there. Yeah, if you guys haven't seen that early January film of uh, Brandon finding the nicest relic we've ever seen come out of that creek, be sure to check it out. All right, we'll be back again here, hopefully in a couple weeks. Show. Weather permit. See ya. Look for us.